continuing on with our little theme, a long, big, fuzzy rope, a medium rope, and a little baby rope. Aww. Aww. I will fold each one in half, small, medium, and large. I give a little wave of the magic wand. <laughs> Trust me, when you need it, it's magic, all right? They become the same length so that we do have one, two, three ropes, all the same length. Having missed an obvious applause cue, yeah. I yeah. Yeah. Now it's cheap. Now, if you have three ropes and take away one, how many does that leave class? Yeah. Right, one. See all, those, see all those wasted years of Sesame Street? Yeah. I'll tie it into a big loop. And of course, if you don't really care for the knot, like the one I gave to you, you can take the knot off, throw it away, wow. and it gives you a loop with no end, something like that. Wow. Now start again. There's a big one, there's a medium one, there's a baby in here. One more time, just in case you missed it. From the beginning, <laughs> small, medium, and large. Which, as you know, is what you call a midget fortune teller who escapes from prison. A small, medium, at large. <laughs> Some jokes you do just for yourself. <laughs> Again, they become the same size. But this time I'll do something a little bit different. I wish you would. Okay. <laughs> I'll tie these two together, and I'll tie on the third. Now, quite plainly, there are three ropes. Two knots will hold them in place. Watch carefully as they merge into one long rope. No extra knots, just like <laughs> that. Yeah.